Court. Todd Egan. Palmer Police Court. Scott DeClaudio. Kenny Powell. Tracy Roman. Therese Young. Diane Gray. Abby Fletman. Kenny Scott. Me and Roberts Perez. Please come on up. Michael Fanny. Chris Bellios. Stephanie Sawyer. Municipal Court. Sharon Williams Lozier. Jonathan Pittman. Christine Hope. And we, I got a call from all our mayor candidates. As you know, it's an open primary. Our six mayor candidates are not being disrespectful. They're at a televised debate tonight. But they're going to try to swing by a little later and shake everybody's hand on the way out. Our mayor candidates, Anthony Hardy Williams, Keith Milton Street, Jimmy Kenny, Doug Oliver, Nelson Diaz, and Lynn Abraham. Let's give all six to doing a great job. We're going to stand here and hurt with anybody. They're working real hard. City Commissioners, Anthony Clark, Lisa Dealey, Pastor Will, Ron Donatucci. Y'all are going Sheriff down Williams. here in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Third Senate of the Democratic Ronald Party Ronald is happening. It's Bob Brady, our fearless leader. William Greenlee. Yeah. Eddie Nielsen. Yeah. W. District. Our district council people. Our district council people. Mark Squilla. Kenyatta yeah. Johnson. Jamie Blackwell, Curtis Jones, Daryl Clark, Bobby Heenan, Cindy Ash, Sherelle Parker. Let's uh -uh. give all our candidates. This is our ticket. This is the city of Philadelphia. This is what the city of Philadelphia looks like right here. I also got a I also got a request from Jimmy Tyoon. Now, he's got to make some money now. You know, let's find his iPhone. The rest of you can't make any money tonight. Jimmy lost an iPhone somewhere, and uh, he may have left it home. You don't know, but he lost an iPhone somewhere. If anybody has the iPhone, would you please bring it up to the, uh, to the DJ, you know, so Jimmy could, uh, so Jimmy could take some pictures. We do got a short program. I'm asking our people, our, our, our speakers, to keep it to one minute because we have a few of them. But you know, the Democratic Party is nothing without labor. And we always have our friends, our labor, our, 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 our labor candidates, our labor people all support our Democratic tickets. Democrats and organized labor, one and the same. So we have here the president of the AFL-CIO, my dear friend, your dear friend, Pat Eiding. Pat, where you at? You're not even a judge yet. You're taking my yard, are judge, aren't you? <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hello. So, are there any labor people in the house? How about working people? Any working people? Yeah. I know that's a bad name in this city, working people, but guess what? We're out there working, and we're going to work right up to election day, but none of that work is any good if we don't vote. So you got to get your family out there. This is one of the most important elections I know about presidents and what have you, but this is our city. This is where we live. we got to vote for hello, people hello, who care. Get out there and vote. We'll Ms. be out Michael, there. How are you? Please be out there with us. Thank you. Thank you, Pat. Also, for Superior Court, one of our own, Alice DeBell. Alice, where are you? Good evening, Philadelphia. 
My name is Todd Egan. I'm running for Commonwealth Court of Pennsylvania. I am from Scranton, Pennsylvania, and we know how to elect Democrats in Scranton just like you know how to elect Democrats here in Philadelphia. And we're going to help get out that Democratic vote up in northeastern Pennsylvania. Just remember my name, Todd Egan for Commonwealth Court Judge. Thank you very much. Also running for re-election without much of a problem because he doesn't deserve a problem because he's doing a great job. Our council president, Daryl Clark. Daryl. Thank you, Bob. Any Democrats in the house? Oh! This is the city of Philadelphia. Right now, real quick, Bob, and I know I only got a minute, but I'm gonna take three. There's some funny stuff going on in this country, right? People trying to come after us, right? But guess what? We are the block between them and us, right? We are going to continue to stand up for the democratic principles, and with this team, and this team on this stage here, we are going to win. All right, so folks, I want to thank you for all your support. Stay strong, continue to do what we got to do, because the people are dependent on you. God bless you all, love you. Thank you, Dad. Now, Representing all district council people, because you don't want to all tell them to speak. But this gentleman's got a race on his hands, and he shouldn't have a race on his hands. He's one of the hardest working council people we have. He's out there every single day on every issue, fighting for his neighbor, fighting for his district. Tinata Johnson. Thanks, Bob. Now, when I ask y'all how y'all feel, I want to hear y'all say, Fired up. How y'all feel? Fired up. How y'all feel? How y'all feel? How y'all feel? I'm running for city council, and the second councilmatic district is not for sale. Listen, I'm going to ask for your support. I want to thank all of my committee people and ward leaders who are supporting me in the second councilmatic district for sending me back to city council, fighting to make sure all of our young people can get a quality education, fighting to make sure that anyone who wants to stay living in their homes, their homes aren't taken away from them as a result of as a result of the increase in taxes, making sure all my young men have an opportunity to get jobs as opposed to picking up guns. And so I want to thank the committee people in the Democratic Party and most importantly the Warriors for their hard work in making sure we get out the vote on May 19th. Thank you very much. My name is Councilman Keanu Johnson. From here to full here. Thank you, Councilman. Also representing all council at large, Ward leader, fellow ward leader, works every single day, 365 days a year, doing council on the ward. Captain Billy Greenley, Billy. Yeah. What do you say, Billy? Democrats, are we ready for a big victory on May 19th? You know, the, the, four, the five of us here, Blondell Reynolds Brown, Sherry Cohen, Wilson Good, Ed Nielsen, we're about the people. We've represented people, we've helped people over the years. There are some other folks out there who want to knock us out because they don't think we represent them. Well, they're the 1%. We represent 100% of the city of Philadelphia. We're gonna keep doing that, and with your help, and with the help of organized labor, we're gonna have a big victory for this whole ticket on May 19th. Thank you all very much. Thank you, Billy. I'll speak for you better than you can speak for yourself. As Billy said, there's a group out there called 3-0. We call them one percenters. They want to try to take out all our council people only because they want to lower our property tax from 20% to 15%. Why? Not a property tax, a parking tax, because they own parking lots. And they want to do development by the developers. We can't let them attack our council people. We gotta vote for our council people at large. Don't let that happen. Also representing all our CP judges, Stephanie Sawyer representing all CP judges. Stephanie. Good evening. Do I hear any Democrats in the house? Good evening. I'd like to thank Bob and everybody here. It's going to take all your hard work. We're about to elect 10% of the Court of Common Pleas. There are 12 seats and only about 120 to 125 CP judges. So 10% is getting ready to get elected. So all of your hard work is needed. I'm Stephanie Sawyer on behalf of all of the endorsed candidates. Please go out there and work hard. And I thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Representing our municipal court judges, one of our own, to get another one in the works 365 days a year. Sharon Lozier, Sharon. Good evening, everyone. Good evening to our chairman, Bob Brady, and members of the Philadelphia Democratic.
Democratic Party. We're here to rally the troops to get out the vote to elect these candidates on election day. On behalf of the three endorsed municipal court candidates, I ask you to start with the number one position on the ballot, which is number 55, me, Sharon williams Lothian. The number two position on the ballot, and number 56, is Jocelyn Pittman. Oh, and number four on the ballot, the top of the second column, is Christine Hope. Number 58. On the ballot, we form like a sideways V. And let's make that V for victory on election day. Thank you. Thank you. Now running for Supreme Court. You know, we don't make deals, but we do make arrangements. And we got a great arrangement from Pittsburgh. They're out there pushing our fellow.